managing high cortisol levels. Cortisol is a hormone produced by the adrenal gland that plays a number of important roles in the body. It helps regulate metabolism, helps the body respond to stress, and helps maintaining blood pressure. So while cortisol is necessary for good health, high levels of cortisol can have negative effects on the body as well. So there are a number of factors that can contribute to high levels of cortisol, including, for example, stress, stress management. So one of the main triggers of high cortisol levels is stress. This can be physical, emotional, or physiological stress. For example, lack of sleep, Cortisol levels are highest in the morning and decline throughout the day. If you are not uh, getting enough sleep, your cortisol levels may be elevated. The second one would be with poor diet. Uh, diet uh, high in sugar and unhealthy fats can lead to increased cortisol levels as well. Certain medications, some medications such as corticosteroids can increase cortisol, cort cortisol levels as well. Illnesses, chronic illness or injury can also lead to high cortisol levels. To help manage high cortisol levels, it's important to address the underlying cause. This may involve finding ways to reduce stress, getting more sleep, eating a healthy diet, and avoiding or managing chronic illness or injury. Some people may also find it helpful to engage in re relaxing techniques such as meditation or yoga or to seek support from a mental health professional. Here are a few additional strategies that may help you recover from high cortisol uh, spikes. Exercise is number one. So regular physical activity can help reduce stress and lower cortisol levels. Aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate intensity exercise, such as brisk walking or cycling on most days or even just weeks. So practice stress reducing techniques, techniques such as deep breathing, deep breathing, cryotherapy, progressive muscle relaxation and mindfulness. Meditation can, can help also um, reduce stress and lower cortisol levels get enough sleep so I cannot underline how important it is as mentioned earlier so lack of sleep can contribute to high cortisol levels aim for seven to nine hours of sleep per night and try to go to bed and wake up at consistent times so I will talk to you soon take care bye bye